one of the coolest thing that you can do with transforms is that you can change the transform origin. By default, the transform origin is the center of the element. For example, here when this element rotates, it rotates according to the center point. And this may be the effect that you want, but you can control the transform origin and make really great transformations. And this is set using the transform origin property. By default, the value is 50% 50%. So let's try to change the transform origin using keywords like top left. And now this is the result. You can see that changing the transform origin creates a new effect. So let's say, for example, bottom right. And now let's try top right. So I hope you got the point. Now you can also set this property using units like pixels. So let's say 20 pixels from the top and 50 pixels from the left. And here is the result. And here is something that is really awesome. You can set a negative value here and let's say for example negative 100 pixels and 50%. Now looking at the result, the transform origin is around here. So the transform origin can be a value outside of your elements, like 150%. So let's type in 150% and 50%. So the origin of the transformation is around here. And now our element rotates according to this point.